Hello again, this is Jake with Van Dyke Software. I'm gonna show you how to move your secure CRT configuration from one machine to another. If you've just gotten a new computer, you don't wanna to have to recreate your sessions, button bars, and so on. This is my old Windows 7 machine, and in Secure CRT I have button bars that I've created and a lot of saved sessions that I don't want to lose. Some of these have saved credentials and other customizations like different color schemes for various hosts. First, I export my configuration to an XML file. In the Tools menu, I choose Export Settings. This is only in version 7.3 and newer, so if you're on an older version, perhaps it's time to consider upgrading. In the Export Settings window, I'll enable all of the options, including License. I'm only exporting the license here because I actually own the license and I'm the only one that will use the resulting XML file. Then I'll choose where to save the resulting XML file and I'll name it something extra special like mysecureCRTconfig.xml. I press the save button, then the export button, and I'll sit back as SecureCRT exports all of my saved settings. Now that it's done exporting, I'll press the close button. Here I can see that two different files were created. One of them is a log file that shows the same information that flew by when the export was in progress. The other file is the one that I really care about. It's the XML file that I'm gonna to copy to my new machine for importing over there. I'll copy this to a flash drive or a network share and from there to my new machine. On my new machine, I've downloaded and installed Secure CRT. And to import my config, I'll have to run Secure CRT in evaluation mode so that I can access the import tool there. So I'll cancel the Quick Connect. You'll notice I don't have any button bars. There's no sessions because I haven't imported any of the settings from the XML file yet. I'll dismiss the session manager and put the XML file on my desktop where it's easy to find. Then I'll go to the tools menu and choose import settings. I'll import my license data since I own the license and I'm moving to a new machine. Then I'll browse for the location of the XML file that I copied over to my desktop. I'll press open, then import, and then I'll wait for the configuration data to be imported. Once the import is finished, I'll shut down Secure CRT and start a fresh instance. I can see my sessions have been imported, as well as my button bars. You'll also notice that the Visual Studio 2013 dark theme that I had in place on the old machine has been applied to this new machine. I'll connect to some of the saved sessions that I had in the old machine and make sure that the credentials still are in place and the color schemes are present. Okay, so now you know how to use SecureCRT's export import tool to move your configuration from an old machine to a new machine. Stay secure, my friends.